if you're not careful and you no clip out of reality in the wrong areas, you will end up in the back rooms, where it's nothing but the stink of old, moist carpet, the madness of mono yellow, the endless background noise of fluorescent lights at maximum humbuzz, and approximately 600 million square miles of randomly segmented empty rooms to be trapped in. God save you if you hear something wandering around nearby, because it sure as hell has heard you. Level 27 The Bunker Springs Survival Difficulty Class 0 Safe Secure Devoid of Entities Level 27 is the 28th level of the back rooms. Description Level 27, also known as the Bunker Springs, is a relatively peaceful and small level, completely devoid of entities. This level appears to be finite, infinite, with the only accessible part being the approximately 200 square feet, 18.6 square meters, hot spring that houses both the entrance and exit to this level, that houses all entrances and all but one exit. The water in this hot spring is potable and mineral rich. Wanderers who have drunk the water of level 27 report feelings of clear-headedness and heightened energy. The temperature of this water averages around 90 degrees Fahrenheit, 32.2 degrees Celsius, similar in temperature to a common hot tub. From the walls of the cave, there are two openings, where two small waterfalls deposit new water into the spring. The small pool is drained by means of a small tunnel near the corner of the cave, which is too small for humans to physically crawl through. Do not attempt to explore it. It is unknown where this water goes and comes from, but the source appears to be infinite. Level 27 is an extremely popular level among those who reside in levels such as level 11 due to its easily accessible and constant exit and entrance. If you decide to visit level 27, please be respectful of any other wanderers you may encounter bathing in the springs. It is not recommended to enter the waters if there are more than 30 or so wanderers currently bathing. The waters of the spring have been proven to have beneficial effects on wanderers who bathe for at least an hour in it. Wanderers have consistently reported feeling less stressed, calmer, and more optimistic than before. Wanderers from level 11 have also shown higher levels of productivity in their jobs. The waters are also known to help alleviate minor physical ailments such as soreness, bruises, rashes, acne, and small cuts. It is not recommended, however, to bathe for more than two hours, as prolonged exposure to hot waters may result in dizziness and nausea. Since this level is very popular and widely used among the residents of level 11, it is also recommended to leave immediately after bathing to make space for other wanderers. The walls of the cave have been determined to be limestone, Despite the natural warm temperatures of the water and the humid air, there is absolutely no vegetation or even living beings of any kind anywhere in level 27. The level is even devoid of bacterial organisms. It is unknown why this is the case. I had the misfortune of finding out why. You thought that this level was going to be just a simple happy little spring, right? A little spark of hope and safety in this terrible place we call the back rooms. Thousands of people thought that was the case. I thought that was the case. They still use this level to this day to unwind from their otherwise stressful lives. It's blissful. It's peaceful. It's beautiful. That illusion was destroyed for me. I'll never visit this level again. But it's still safe to enter. It'll still be your lovely cute hot spring, as long as you don't read on. But I know who you are. You're a wanderer. You're curious by default. That's the very nature of our poor souls. So if you really want to know what this level is, I'll show you my discovery. Don't say I didn't warn you. Report. 
in L-27. Expedition Log Number 1. Recording Date, June 9th, 2021. Logger, Catherine Goswell, MEG Operative. Today I was chosen to explore the other waterfall cave in level 27. Half of me was glad that I got such an easy job, but half of me was also upset because it was bound to be boring. I mean, level 27 is just a hot spring. There aren't even any entities, so what exactly do they expect me to find? Whatever. I got my gear and I entered the level the way everyone else does. Thankfully, the MEG put out a notice to the people in level 11 to make sure nobody tries to hop in while I'm doing my work. Kudos to them for being so considerate, I guess. I would really rather not have a naked man staring at me while I'm scaling the cliff wall. I've never been the best at climbing, but I was sort of glad that this was the level where I first put my equipment training into practice. After all, a fall from here would land me in the water, and I'd walk away with a few small cuts or a bruise at most. Lucky me, because this water would help heal them for me even if that did happen. So here I was, climbing up inch by inch, one foot over the other. This side of the wall was smooth instead of jagged, but eventually I was able to latch onto the edge of the opening and haul myself up. Honestly, the more I struggled, the more I realized just how thankful I was that nobody was here to watch me. I don't think my colleagues would have ever let me live it down if they saw how much I flailed about. But that's besides the point. I pulled the mask over my head as I crawled through the tunnel, my back bumping against the ceiling. I fought against the current, suddenly regretting my life choices. Warm water splashed everywhere, and even through my mask I had to shut my eyes. Ugh. This brought back very, very fond memories of swirling in a certain high school bathroom. The tunnel continued on and on and on. I lost track of time and distance altogether. I couldn't tell you how far I crawled through the steamy water. All I know is that after what seemed like forever, the tunnel finally widened enough for me to stand upright as I emerged into a vast cavern. Its walls were so far away that they were clothed in complete darkness. I couldn't give you an exact measurement of how big it was. The thing I remember the most about it was the opening in the ceiling. Through the hole, I could see the sky of level 27. It was a deep indigo blue. There was a pile of rocks rising out of the water leading up to the exit, and I took shaky and hesitant steps as I ascended. When I emerged into the open air, nothing could have prepared me for what I saw. Underneath the dark blue sky was a barren plain of nothing but black rock. There were no trees, no entities, no life. Everything was flatter than a sheet of paper. Every hill had been leveled, every mountain had been crushed, Every civilization had been obliterated, and everything the highest peak from the smallest ant was gone. There was nothing but the black rock that stood at my feet, coating the entire surface like a hideous layer of black paint. Stormstone. The rock was Stormstone. I realized that the hot spring of level 27 wasn't the entire of the level. No, no, no. It was the only part of the level left. I turned back around to flee into the cave, only to find that it was gone. I was trapped in an endless field of nothing. I knew that if I took a single step forward, I'd activate the storm stone and cause it to explode. I thought I was dead. My entire life played before my eyes like a sick movie on fast forward. I took a deep breath and stepped forth, preparing to die. I closed my eyes. When I woke up, I was in an armchair in Stormstone Keep, and there was a mug of coffee on the table in front of me. End of log. Bases, outposts, and communities. There are no bases, outposts, or communities on this level due to its size and its history. Entrances and exits. Level 27 can be exited and entered through the same way. Near the corner of the cave by one of the waterfalls, the MEG have constructed a stairway that leads up towards the tunnel that the waterfall flows out of. The tunnel is wide enough to walk through alongside the stream. Following it will lead out of level 27 and back into the same location you entered it from. Level 27 can be easily entered 
through turning a functional shower or bath to its hottest setting, and closing your eyes while inside it. The most popular way to enter level 27 is through level 11. This will always bring you to the tunnel entrance, where you may descend the staircase and enter the springs. Don't climb the other waterfall tunnel. It leads nowhere. <laughs>